just how to play the game! That is an epic fucking intro, dude. As gross as this could be, and I have to warn everyone, warning, what you may see right now is going to be absolutely disgusting. Oh my goodness, excuse me. Sound good? Oh, I really hate you, but I cannot live without you if I try. I can't imagine life without you, ice cream. So creamy. I think a lot of people were expecting me to have like a drama segment here on pre-stream today. Nope. I don't care about what anyone says about me and the shit people make up about me anymore. That's 100% a lie. I mean, it gets to the point where daily now there's just such stupid stuff that's said and done. I just don't care anymore. Um, at this point, ladies and gentlemen, if you haven't figured it out, it doesn't really matter what people say or do about me anymore. I'm still going to be here and I'm still going to persevere and I'm still going to maintain and I'm still going to survive through all of the, the crap that they throw against me. Ah, the salty tears. He was the guy that got caught masturbating in front of children. It's the so guy cool. watching his Twitch. Is that really him? Is he the yes. one that got caught? Matt? Yes. yes! I mean, when it gets to the point where now they have to completely fabricate stuff uh, in order to say stuff about me, that's the point where you know, well, okay. You know, there was a time. There was a time, ladies and gentlemen, where I, on a regular basis, was kind of uneducated about topics. Um, I didn't really care about what I said or did in a video. This is before I even live streamed. Um, there was a time when, you know, I was a very controversial polarizing figure on YouTube because I was known as one of the top gaming YouTubers, but you would ask me about Minecraft and I would rip the game a new asshole and insult anyone who wanted to ever play it. You know what I mean? But that was a, a very long time ago. All right. A very long time ago. Things have changed over the years and I've matured and grown. <laughs> Ready to suck. Oh yeah, yeah, I suck it out. Nice and deep in there. And even though every once in a while, let's face it, yeah, there's something embarrassing that happens, something, you know, a moment of weakness or something stupid. I'm not infallible. I admit, I, you know, I make mistakes, I do stupid stuff, or have, you know, accidents may happen or whatever, right? Oh, 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 oh. God. What the fuck? I'm constantly masturbating all around my streaming equipment, just so you guys know. My microphone was muted, so that wasn't me. It doesn't really matter. You know, the latest stuff, the most ridiculous stuff, again, more fabricated nonsense that people are saying about me. I don't care. I don't care. There's no reason to even bring up what it is. There's no reason to address. It's so stupid. When, when the criticism that you receive and the ridicule that you receive is so weak that people are literally fabricating garbage, like, oh, you were with an escort for Christmas, you know, this kind of stupid shit. <clears throat> At this point, there's nothing else that can be done. You know what I mean? Like, they've said and done everything they possibly could against me. They've done everything. It doesn't matter anymore what's said or done against me anymore. I'm going to persevere, and I'm still going to be here, folks. I'm not going anywhere. Oh my God, please, you got to tip me because I have no money. So fucking greedy. I've got an amazing positive thing going for me here on Twitch. I love interacting with you guys. Things are going great. You know, it's been very positive all around. I got my girlfriend moving in this week. That's going to be incredibly positive and amazing for me. Like, there's all these things going for me, right? Why on earth would I care about what a bunch of nudniks, right, have to say? <laughs> about me. Or, or the, the shit that they'll make up, or the out-of-context stuff, or the things without substantiation. Because that's the problem. That's the thing now. They have nothing else to talk about. There's nothing concrete. There's no more drama going on. They have to fabricate shit. And it gets so ridiculous to the point where it's like, I'm not going to sit here and address it every day anymore. It's a waste of my time. So, I don't care. Silver-tongued talker, right? Oh, I'm just going to say it one way, and hopefully you'll believe it, even though that's not the truth. And that's literally what's happening here. The guy's a liar. The guy's a fucking blatant liar and lying to everyone. But people are believing it because they don't know any better. And that's it, folks. I just want to say thank you for staying positive. Thank you for being here. Let's have a fun day together, right? Let's just focus on having fun on stream. And sadly enough, when it comes April, I may need to do another fundraiser to pay my taxes. And that's what it's all about. 
It really is. You know, I just don't care about the drama anymore. I'm not going to sit here and address every little thing that happens and every little nonsense story that people make up about me. And It's just so dumb. It just doesn't make any sense anymore. It, it <laughs> Shout out! <laughs> Papa Lou, oh boy. Papa Lou, to the 25-bit cheer. Thank you. Really, thank you. My girlfriend is obviously Papa Lou in a wig. Sugar Daddy. I am a heterosexual through and through. He says, Phil, I want to tell you, I know I cross the line sometimes, but I want you to know I root for your success every day. Well, thank you, Papa Lou, for that positive message. I appreciate that. Thank you. Papa Lou did a cheer. Thank you. Chris says, can I be ambassador again? All right, Papa Lou. I think you've learned your lesson. It's been a couple days now, right? Papa Lou has now been reinstated as the stream ambassador. It was now his job to make sure everyone's having a good time. We also, <clears throat> we determined that he should not be kicked for no reason on a stream chat. And I am adhering to that. I don't want mods to be bullying him. Papa Lou has now been reinstated as the stream ambassador. There you go. I love you, Papa Lou. I love you. And then he did another cheer. This guy fucking sucks my dick. And said, Oh my god, where did you hear this one? Have you ever walked behind someone in the street thinking, hey, she's got a nice ass, only to realize later it was a man the whole time, but still being okay with feeling attracted to the ass knowing it was a man's? Yes. <sighs> no, Pabalu. I can't say that's ever happened to me. People don't believe me anymore. And that's the problem is I ignore it and I got people accusing me who are fans of mine saying they think that it might be true. And I'm like, are you crazy? And Papa Lou did another cheer. Thank you very, 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 very much. And he said, Dear Phil, I would like to have an emote referencing you on my stream. Do I have permission to make one? I will love you regardless of your answer. Don't worry. If I were a real jerk, I could complain to Twitch if you used my, my visage, my image without my permission. However, I have no plans to do that. So if you really wanted to do an emote of me, however, I would ask this. Do not copy one of my emotes, please. Do not do one of mine. If you're going to do something, do something, you know, unique. Okay? Sound good? Critical for days. Did a 30-bit cheer and says, since you have been doing lots of streaming lately, what's the difference between someone that is a nice person and does entertaining stuff for the fans and someone who's being a clown to his fans to gave him $1,000 and the guy being an asshole? That's like me, right? That's like me. Um, here's the thing, critical for days. Here's, this is my true belief, all right? If you actually love what you do, all right, you're going to come out and you're going to do it every day. You're going to have fun doing it. And it doesn't matter if it's a day, if you make no money. What? What? <laughs> what? What the fuck? Are you fucking serious? What the fuck? If it's a day that you make okay money or a day that you do great with money. It's not about that. It's not about the money. It's not. I'm not here to take a paycheck. I'm good at lying. <laughs> Alright, now, let's be real adults here. Let's be realist here. Yeah, if you are operating a business and if streaming is the way that you pay your bills, obviously, on average, you have to have at least decent days every day so that you can pay your bills. I need th that money. I really do. I need that money to pay my bills. But it's my opinion, and, and I'll be very honest here, in the year here that I have now focused on just doing positive streams on Twitch, <clears throat> even though, yes, I do a plug segment before I start with gameplay, once the gameplay begins, it's pretty much about me in the game and interacting with you guys on stream. It's not about, we need more money, we need more money, this and this and this, right? Very rarely after I even do pre-stream will I even mention things like that at all, okay? Unless, I mean, there's been a couple situations, like the end of last year where this tax situation came up out of nowhere. Okay, that was an extenuating circumstance. That wasn't something that I expected to happen, right? But for the most part, that's not what it's about. <clears throat> if you love what you do, you're going to come out and you're going to do it regardless and have fun doing it, and then the success comes with it. You know, I'll say this again. Back when I was on YouTube, before I ever made a dime doing it, I did it for two years as a hobby. Then when I lost my job... And I enabled, I was able to enable ads on my videos. All of a sudden, there was an outpouring of support. I had already loved what I was doing. The success came later. The financial success comes later, right? People who make it all about the entire reason that I'm here today is because I need to get a certain amount of subs, 
I'm not even going to turn the stream on until I make a $50 tip. Uh, you know, I'm not going to do this in the game until someone cheers. That's ridiculous. That's, that's pretty much to the point of his extortion. Your support right now with cheers, subs, and tips is paying the bills. I need to raise a lot of money this month. I'm going to need your guys' help. I really am. I'm going to need your support. I need it. I'm not going to even enjoy games and put out a quality stream for you until you pay me. That's like me, right? That's like me. Yeah, I'm a gamer! That's ridiculous. Okay? I completely disagree with that. That mentality. I think that, the, like I said, if you're already here to do fun stuff, and it's all it's all about you being real, about loving games, and doing what you do as an entertainment value every day, and also, let's face it, if you're an entertaining personality, if you're a positive person people like to interact with, then the money's gonna come afterward, right? It's gonna come naturally. You don't have to work so hard for it to come in. Is saying, how can we have revenue streams from idiots? How do we fool the common moron into giving us money for zero effort? I mean, let's be honest here. Not exactly most intelligent people on the planet. Cheer, sub, and tip me, all right? So, I don't know how stupid you could be. I really don't. Some people are just really fucking stupid, I guess. I mean, you're paying me. you paying me money to get a temporary, momentary pop-up on the screen. All right. It's just so ludicrous. It's just, <laughs> it's so stupid. And most people don't pay attention to it. It's like the double whammy of stupid. I don't even know what else to say. <laughs> it's pretty damn funny. Okay. It's pretty stupid. It's, dumb people are so dumb. You got to just fucking tell what's what. I, I just want to play games and have fun and make a living doing it. And it's been pretty amazing. You guys have been so positive and supportive of me, you know, that I'm just here and I'm able to enjoy myself and I don't have to really worry too much about it, right? I mean, it's rare when I have to come out and say, guys, we really need tons of money today. When do I say that, right? Very rarely, like I said, the one time was the end of last year when a tax situation came up out of nowhere. And sadly enough, when it comes April, I may need to do another fundraiser to pay my taxes. But for the most part, things are great, you know. I can't complain. So, that's the difference, you know, I think at least critical for this. You know, I can't really answer that, because then you say, oh, you know, what about this guy or this guy? I don't feel that I'm those guys, you know. I don't, I don't feel that I'm in a situation where I do those kind of things. That's 100% a lie. Um, you know, there are, sadly, there are people out there who exploit, uh, and they find ways to exploit, exploit, exploit constantly. And that's not what I'm about. You know, I do my, my, my pre-stream and then it's done. And then we get to, to the meat of the stream and there you go. Right. Um, so I honestly, I honestly could not answer any further than how I just did. You know, I got to do from my own perspective. Okay. Pompaloo did another cheer. Some people are just fucking idiots. What else can I say? You got to be an idiot. Thank you so much. Would it be okay if it had something to do with you when you were itching your leg? Oh my god, here we go. Oh, 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 oh. God. Papa Lou, you're going to get banned from Twitch. <laughs> it's not going to be me. Trust me, even I can't do an emo in regards to that. I was denied making my own emo in regards to that. So, you're not going to be able to do it, okay? It's You, you want to know what's really fun for me, guys? And I'm going to be honest with you guys. I used to be so nervous about whenever I streamed or made videos. I was like, man, I got to do something people are going to watch. It's views, views, views. Views, views, views. I don't want to be Mr. Views. People got to get going to watch. They have to have views. High views so I can pay my bills. High views, high views. I don't even care anymore. Like, I've been playing PUBG. I've been playing... Today I'm playing all multiplayer games. I doubt many people are going to watch these on YouTube. I don't really care. I'm having fun. And it's fun. It's crazy because I'm having fun. People are coming out and having a good time on the stream no matter what I'm playing. So, I, I, I like... It's like the pressure. I'm not even kidding. This pressure that I've had on my shoulders for years is slowly releasing. This, this crazy pressure of I gotta put out stuff people are gonna go crazy on YouTube for and I gotta put it out in a timely manner and you know I'm getting I'm becoming more relaxed I'm actually becoming more you know what I mean like it's it's good this is really good a really good positive more laid back relaxed less nervous less tense less stress all the time feeling and it's feeling good man it is it's feeling great so thanks for the money, dummies, because that's exactly what you fucking are. A bunch of fucking empty-headed idiots who paid me money to get absolutely nothing out of it. Thanks. <laughs> wow.
What pasta do you prefer? I prefer a penne. Oh! Easy to eat. Oh! Phil's a faggot. Phil's fat. Phil's a loser. Phil's a beggar. DSP's a pedophile. DSP is a thief. DSP is a greedy fuck. I have a micro penis. <laughs> Alright, I'm not dead, but I swear to God, I wish I fucking was.